Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. So today we are going to be doing Am I on their mind? What do they, uh, are they thinking about me right now? So we've got group number one with the Aura Quartz. We've got number two with the Tiger's Eye. And we've got number three with the Aragonite. So if you'd like to choose group one, two or three to see what, if you're on their mind. And let's get started. Hello group number one, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Let's see uh, if you're on their mind. So let's see what they are going through. We've got this gorgeous Aura Quartz. I love this, isn't this just stunning? <laughs> it's so pretty. Aura Quartz I think is one of my favorite crystals. And we got Love and Crossroads, wow. So that's pretty much like, pretty obvious. So now we're gonna have a look into the tarot and let's see what's going on with this person. So am I on their mind right now? The Hermit, Three of Swords, oh wow, got the Lovers, the Moon, yeah this is pretty much what it says in the Crystal Grid Oracle cards, Ace of Swords, we've got the Lovers right in the middle and we've got the Two of Cups, wow that's amazing, Can we have one more card for the overall energy. Okay, two more cards, okay? So underneath the deck we have the Emperor, which is pretty much saying this person's being a little bit stubborn right now. Um, and they're not they're not really budging. I don't see this person as being too stubborn. I feel for some of you who are watching this video, they could be like really, really stubborn. But for a lot of you, I don't see them being that stubborn. I feel like they're just kind of confused. Um, and they may just have like a pattern that they have in love that may kind of make them look stubborn. But I don't think they actually are stubborn. So the overall energy you've got is the page, sorry I can't talk, <laughs> we've got the overall energy, I feel like that's what it's saying as well, they can't talk to you at the moment, which is why I'm, I can't talk right now. Um, so the overall energy you've got is the page of wands with the world. This person wants to come forward to you um, and start something new I feel like, that's basically what's on their mind and you are on their mind, you, you are, I feel like they're thinking deeply about this situation. They're in hermit mode right now because they're like deeply thinking about what's going on. They're deeply thinking about, oh, my past has been so awful. Like everything has like not worked out for me. It's been really, really bad. I don't really know what to do. And that's basically this energy. But then they're thinking, oh, I really love this person. There is so much love here for you, honestly. I've got the love here and we've got crossroads. The reason why they, they are in this crossroads, they're like confused of where to go, is because they love you so much. So that's basically what's going on here. They've got all these emotions that they want to share with you, but they just can't do it right now. That's why they're in the hermit. This is them in their hermit mode, confused by these two wolves, this scorpion, this moon, and this sun. They're like, oh, there's too much going on. This is a crossroads here with this two, um, these two towers. Like that's this crossroads. And I think they're the same color. Oh my God, they're actually the same color. That's so funny. Oh my God. So yeah, that's a definite synchronicity. Um, and the crossroads is like a brown colour, which is similar to like the Emperor's energy, where it's kind of like brown and like kind of um, grounded. So I associate the colour brown with like groundedness. So I do say it's this person, you are on their mind um, because they are thinking about you and they want to come forward. They're just like, I feel like they will decide to come forward. I feel like they will because we've got the Ace of Swords, we've got the Two of, what, two of Cup, then we've got the Four of Swords. I feel like once they decide, they're going to be more content. They want to know what do you think about it. Um, because they're almost like, they know what you think, but they want to keep asking you, what do you think? So the fact that we've got the lovers and we've got the two of cups is just amazing. I feel like you are in their mind. Um, this is what they think about you. They think they want, they love you, Then, but they're at a crossroads right now. And um, But they do want to come towards you. I feel like you possibly, for some of you, you're in long distance relationships. Um, or you're just long distance and you're quite far away from each other. I feel like this person wants to travel or they want to travel with you. It's almost like this person's offering this wand to this lady in the middle, but she's all, she's almost like juggling these two wands already. So it's almost like she's confused and this person and the guy and the, your partner or the person you're dealing with is confused as well. Both of you are very confused, but this is actually the most simple reading I've, I've had in a while in terms of like a pick a card so I feel like you guys it's obvious that this person loves you and I feel like you love them back um but they're just at a crossroads right now but they're, they're just they're just confused because they're just they've had so much going on in their love life 
and it's been really shitty but I feel like it's going to end up really good for you and you're definitely on their mind. So look out for number three, repeating number four and number five and possibly number six. I feel like number six possibly could be your life path number for a few of you. And I feel like some of you could be Scorpios or Libras. I'm not sure why that's just coming out. And also Leos. Okay. Uh, so thank you so much for watching this video. I really, really appreciate it. If you'd like to subscribe to my channel, I would really, really appreciate it. So thank you so much. If you'd like to purchase a private reading, you can message me on my Instagram or you can email me at Victoria here to inspire. Uh, is that, did I say that? Yeah, Victoria here to inspire at gmail.com. Um, if you would like to like this video, feel free and comment down below if it's resonated. If it didn't resonate, then just let it fly. So thank you so much for watching and I'll speak to you very soon. Group one, bye. Hello, group number two. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. So today we have the gorgeous tiger's eye. So for this group, I feel like for a lot of you, there's a lot of energy, a sort of built up stress energy because tiger's eye is a lot to do with energy. There's a lot of kind of like possibly arguing or aggression or there's some sort of like built up like, oh, I just want something to move. That sort of energy. And we've got heart protection here, which is pink fluorite. Okay, so let's see what's going on with you guys. And let's see, are you on their mind? So let's have a look at that right now. Okay, so we have the Six of Pentacles. Page of Pentacles. Ace of Cups. Gorgeous. I love the Ace of Cups. It's like my favourite card. Let me move over a little bit. I feel like the pivotal change is right in the middle. So the card, that I, the third card I pick, I feel like is like the pivotal change that's going to happen. Yeah, and then we, wow, holy shit. And then we, okay, so we've got the, I'm going to show you these cards in a minute, guys. So we've got the nine of wands. I feel like this person's very confused. You're confused. I feel like one of you is being stubborn and is holding back. And is like, no, 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 I don't want to tell you how I actually feel. Um, and you'll never know. And that's that protection it's the heart protection they're protecting themselves they don't want to get hurt and i feel like that's the same with you could be you or this person but i feel like it's mainly this person hence why i feel like you're watching this video because you're like why are they not contacting me or you know that sort of feeling so we have the king of swords knight of cups the fool and then we also have king of wands and judgment so we've got two kings and one night, which is really good. So I feel like this person could be in two minds. They could be in like the, the sexual mind and then like the logical mind. They almost like want to do things with you on like an intimate level, but they're kind of trying to think straight about it. And they're kind of like, oh, I don't know what to do. Do I want a commitment? Do I want just to fling? Ah, I'm confused. And that's this. It's like so many options. I'm getting so hot, guys. Oh, I'm getting so hot. So I feel like it's, that's the intense energy that I'm talking about. Like that intense, like emotional energy. And it could also be like intimate and sexual energy. But when I get hot, it does seem to be a big clarification that something that I, what I just said is true. So hopefully it resonates for some of you. So as I said, Ace of Cups in the middle is a pivotal point where things are going to change. So at the moment, um, are you on their mind? Yes, I feel like you are because they're trying to... But at the moment, for some of you... For some people who you're connecting with, and for like half of you, they are in their mind, yes. But for the other half, they're still in their mind, but they're focusing more on their money right now. They're trying to balance out their finances. Um, and they're trying to like look in another direction for another option. I'm getting really tickly underneath my chin. That was so strange. I don't know what that's about. Don't know if don't know if your person tickles you under the chin or you get this as like a synchronicity or a sign. But I felt like a soft kind of tickle underneath my chin. That was very strange. Um, never had that before. So, yeah, we've got the Six of Pentacles with the uh, Page of Pentacles. So, yeah, this is just like they're trying to find answers in places that they shouldn't be looking. It's almost like, yeah, I feel like once they realise what they want, they're going to come forward with you, towards you. And then we got, so we've got the King of Swords and the King of Wands, which is absolutely amazing. They're basically just trying to sort themselves out and trying to be like, hey, what do I want? How am I going to deal with this situation? It's like, oh, I really want to go forward. They're really attractive, but I've been hurt in the past. But I really, really like them, but I've been hurt in the past. It's almost like they're in two minds, but I definitely feel like for some of you, I don't feel like all of you, but for some of you, they will come forward. 
um, and I feel like this Knight of Cups is connected to the Ace of Cups. For some of you, they will step up and they will come forward, which is really, really nice. And they've got, I love this, because we've got Gorgeous Knight of Cups, who's one of my, it's one of my favourite cards. Knight of Cups and the Ace of Cups, two of my favourite cards. I love them. So we've got the Knight of Cups, the Judgment, and the Fool. So it's basically like, you're going to go forward in this situation, like you're going to move forward, and it's going to be commitment and a new start. So whoever you are watching this, for some of you, you're going to have a really, really good commitment coming in. Um, this person just needs to sort out their heart protection. I feel like it could be also be you, possibly being scared if this person's actually going to come forward or not. Okay, so in terms of are you on your mind, are, are they on your, wait, are you on their mind? Yes, and I feel like they are thinking about you. Uh, as I say, but for some of you, they could be thinking more about their money. Um, but for some, they really want a connection. They're just not sure about it yet because they're just protecting their heart. They're just scared. Uh, they want me to pull this card. Yeah, that's a commitment right there. Gorgeous. And then we've got the uh, Seven of Swords, Four of Wands, and the Ace of Wands, which is, guys, this is absolutely gorgeous. Look, look at this. They've got the Tower, and they've got the Knight of Pentacles, they've got the Two of Swords. So it's, yeah, definite like tower energy. There's something going on here. It's going to blow up, I think, at some point. They're going to be like, damn it, I love this person. I'm going to go forward. Um, yeah. So not for all of you guys, but I feel like for a lot of you, they are going to come forward so thank you so much for watching this video if you would like to subscribe to my channel i would really really appreciate it. you guys are absolutely amazing thank you so much for supporting me on this journey if you would like to uh, purchase a private reading the information is down below you can uh, message me on instagram or you can email me at victoria here to uh, victoria here to inspire at gmail.com um, if you would like to comment down below if this resonated, like this video. If it didn't resonate, just let it fly or you can choose another group. So thank you so much for watching and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye. Hello group number three. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. So you guys got Aragonite and Aragonite is a very intense crystal. It's like pretty much the crystal of change. And now I'm holding this, my third eye is going whoop, whoop, whoop. So I feel like you guys are concreting a foundation at the moment. So you're just trying to find your feet and I feel like... Yeah, that's pretty much... I'm seeing, like, massive change going on. Oh, I'm just like... Sorry, I squeaked on my table. So we've got ground. Yep, exactly. You guys need to ground yourself. And soul healing. Yeah, I definitely feel like a massive intense... I love how this is, like, literally this colour. I love that. I look how much that blends in. That's absolutely amazing. I love it when these things just, like, come together. It just makes me so damn happy. So let's see. Are you on their mind? So let's have a look. Wow, I've got the tower, gorgeous. As I say, massive change. Aragonite is just all about change. I love Aragonite. It's such a good crystal. If you guys want to make a massive impact in your life or you want to change something up or just get something moving, Aragonite is such a good crystal to use. Okay. Gorgeous, right? Get one more. Okay, so we have the Four of Pentacles, which is basically one of you being a little bit stubborn, or one of you is just focusing on money right now. Okay, so looking at these cards in terms of are you on their mind? Yes, I feel like for some of you, yes, but for some of you, no, uh, because some of the person that you're connecting with is, is as I say, is quite stubborn and they're focusing on their money right now so they're not really focusing on you um but they are in terms of they are on your mind for like pretty much all of you because but they're just confused so they're on you're on their mind but they're still confused about what to do so i don't see any movement forward for for some of you i feel like there is but for a lot of you i don't see there's going to be a, some movement forward i feel like some of you are going to separate and this is just not going to be kind of a thing but for a lot of you this tower is going to happen and they're going to suddenly realize what they're missing and they're going to want to come forward towards you if not they're going to go off and do their own thing i feel like they may come towards you and you're going to be like why weren't you here like two or three months ago like this has been a long time coming do you know what i mean um and you may just be like no what i'm gonna i'm gonna go off on my own but for some of you who accept the offer um they are going to come forward towards you. We've got a grounded offer here with action. So there's going to be a new offer coming in with the King of Swords and the Knight of Pentacles and the Fool. 
The Overall Energy is the Ten of Swords. So this is like the end of a cycle. So after this Ten of Swords, there's going to be the Tower. Which is amazing. So it's going to be like a new start. I love how both of these are like really black. So there's like really, really raw, intense energy. And that's pretty much what Aragonite is. It's just intense, dramatic change. Um, so we've also got the Empress and the King of Swords. I feel like if this offer comes to some of you, some of you may not want this because you're like, Do you know what, I've been working on myself. Where have you been? Um, therefore, this rejection might be, this offer might be rejected. But for some of you, if you do want to go forward, this can be a very fruitful offer. And you can, either, if you work on it, both of you are willing to work on this connection. It's going to be really, really fruitful. And you're going to, some of you are going to get married. So it just depends on how the, the connection has gone on. If it's really, really like not salvageable, then obviously it's not going to work. But for a lot of you, if this person can ground themselves and they can heal what has gone on. If they can heal this pattern of possibly leaving people when it gets too hard, for some of you um or focusing too much on their money i feel like they're going to come towards you and they're going to ground themselves for some of you i feel like this person's the person you're connecting with is too grounded hence why they may be focusing on their money too much but i feel like if they connect with this with their soul and they hear what's going on and they ground themselves and they really get deep into the shitty shit shit <laughs> then they're really going to go towards you and they're going to it's going to be amazing guys so in terms of are you on their mind yes and do they think about you yes um yeah so that's basically what's going on i feel like i need to pull out one more card yes we've got heart protection this is what group two had i think or group one um so some of you are there protecting their heart from each other either you're protecting your heart from them or they're protecting their heart from you okay but i feel like this is going to loosen off once this healing comes in the grounding i love these two cards because it's almost like they're showing me like the masculine and the feminine this is the masculine this is the feminine so i feel like this person just needs to kind of bring in more femininity to kind of like get the like grease the wheels kind of thing like juice things up a little bit and kind of get things moving instead of being like really stubborn and being an ass basically like an asshole <laughs> um okay so thank you so much for uh watching guys if this resonated for you then please get a big thumbs up comment down below please subscribe to my channel if you would if you would like to i would absolutely love to have you here um and you can stay updated on more videos that i'm uploading i do private readings so if you want to get a private reading i'm doing 10 percent off in the entire amount of august so if you'd like to get 10 percent off then uh, let me know um, by emailing me or messaging me on Instagram. So I also do discounts pretty much a lot of the time anyway. So just keep I'll keep you updated, guys. Um, so yeah, my rates are normal, always in the description box down below. Yeah, so thank you so much for clicking on this video. And I'll speak to you very soon. Bye.